Okay, so what we got here, we got Philippus Audax, the bold jumping spider. And we got this guy, what, a month or so ago? A month and a half? And she immediately retreated into a nest of her own building, this big silken lob that you see up there. And she also laid some eggs. And so what I'm about to do is open up this container and see if we can get a better picture of this. It's taped a little too firmly shut. Okay, the tricky part is that she built her nest right up against the lid, so I don't know and when I when I start to peel this open, she may have uh, it may tear open the egg sac and all those little babies come running out. So we got to be prepared for that. So anyway, here we go. Just opening it carefully. Trying not to tear it too much. It's going to be kind of unavoidable. Oh man, this is really taped ridiculously securely. There's got to be a better way. Okay. That's putting a lot of strain on the sack, but there we got it out. It's on the lid. And then what I'm going to do is let's put it on the scope and see what we can see. Oh, that tape. Goodbye. No more. Okay, I'm going to see. I have got tape all over myself now. It's really annoying. Okay, here we go. We are turning on the camera. Got to put it on live first. Let's stop it down a little bit. Stop it down a lot because that's a big egg sack in there. Okay. So there's the egg sac. Can I see anything? In, oh, there's darkness inside of it. And that's about all I can see. Focusing up and down. Oh, come on. Battery's good. That's good. Starting over. Okay, so there's a gigantic egg sac here. I don't see the spider itself. Let's get in with some forceps and see if we can get a little, little better view. Okay, what I'm doing is I'm just tearing the egg sac a little bit. I don't want them to escape just yet. Peeling that back. Oh, somebody moved in there. Anyway, I'm just gently tearing at the egg sac, trying to peel apart the fibers so that I can get at the embryos. And maybe the mother spider and see how she's doing. Oh man, she has wrapped this up so securely.
Okay, I've got a hole there. Let's just gonna zoom in with the scope. Once I get it torn open enough. Who's in there? Okay, let's go zoom in up a little bit. see something. I don't know what it is. It's big and it's black and it's hairy. So bull jumpers are fairly good sized jumping spiders. I think that's all I'm seeing here. She doesn't seem very responsive either. I'm going to drag out the second pair of forceps. I can't tell if she's alive. both dissect out that egg sac and keep it in focus. Oh, I see green jaws. I see eyes. Oh, her eyes don't look good. They're pink. What's going on here? a deceased jumping spider here. Totally unresponsive. Okay, she's quite well. Let's see if we can focus down and Man, that's just kind of uninterpretable to everyone else, I bet. But I can see her eyes, they look a little bit collapsed, and I can see her green mandibles. Okay, I think she might be a dead, dead spider. Okay, let's move over here. There's a dark mass deep in this egg sac. Oh man, this egg sac is tough. She knows how to make an egg sac. Oh look! There's the babies. Babies are fine. So they are all squirming away. Looking healthy. Let's see if I can get a better view. Okay, I'm going to put some fruit flies in here so that they've got something to hunt when they come out. Oh, come on. 
they're thickly cocooned and at the same time the cocoon is kind of sticky so it's kind of hard to open this up enough but look at them all those little black bottoms which you probably can't see because the stupid thing keeps moving So I have to zoom in on that a little bit, see what we can see in the scope. So there they are, a bunch of baby bull jumpers. They're looking happy and healthy. Mom didn't make it, but they're looking good. So what I'm going to do next is I'm just going to put these this container back together, and then I'm going to throw some... Uh, little fruit flies in there and we'll let them go hunting. Okay. Anyone want to adopt some bold jumping spiders? Because we have a lot now. Alright, that's it.